and welcome back to the Unboxers. And today we have a clue. Yes. <laughs> we have the game Clue. Check it out. So this is actually like a clue towel. It's a backpack game beach towel set. Great for the beach. Um, it says great for the beach, pool, or park. And we say, or the living room. Yes. Wherever you can stretch it out and play Clue. And it but is of course, by... Da, da, da. Hasbro, Hasbro Gaming. Gaming. So, um, you can go ahead and turn it back around. Oh. Um, so, it says that it the set includes one towel, one tote bag, and game pieces. And it gives you the towel size, 58 inch by 58 inch. Oh, it's a square. Uh-huh. Very cool. Well, I guess I should have known that, but yeah. <laughs> the game board. I mean, most towels are not, but yeah, it yeah. would make sense. So I'm super excited to see the game pieces come out of this and um, stretch this thing out. So let's take a look at the front. So it looks like it's going to be set up exactly like the clue board, um, and then you can put it in the and wear it on your back and have it for yeah. travel. So um, if you grew up with these Hasbro games, you know, um, we played Clue, and it was always a big thing. Like, there we, there wasn't as many board games out. Right, So right. you had your classics, you know, you got your Monopoly, you got your... And Clue was definitely one of my favorites. Um, so let's go ahead and take the packaging off of there and see what comes inside. Okay. And then we will stretch it out and, uh, and show you what it looks like um, outside of the studio so you can get the full picture of it. So it come undone under there? Yeah, I was just reading the back because it says um, carefully cut tag away to remove. Do not pull. So I just want to make sure. Okay. I wasn't... Okay. So there's the straps. Ooh, there's the straps. That's cool. Now they're like. Oh, they are. Um, like here. Let's carefully. Well, I guess we're not going to put it on our back. Yeah, right we can now, just so leave, we'll it leave it for now. It. Oh, it does have a. Um, it does have a thing at the top. Okay. The, like a little. Yeah, you do want to carefully undo these so that you don't damage the um, the towel. I see. Yeah, and this is actually not the towel itself. This no, is this the is the bag. Yeah. Bag, but still. There you go. All right. Oh, I see it. Oh, look at the front. That is cool. So cool. You got the stairs. Whoa. Oops. Whoa. That looks awesome. Here, you can set this over here. Okay, so here's what the bag looks like. That is cool. And it does, it has the uh, two straps sewn on the back. And then you have a pull string here to, to close it up, which is really cool. Oh, that's so cool. And then you get the straps on the back. And they're made of the towel material as well. That's awesome. We'll set that over there. All the right. funny thing is, is like even if you didn't have the game in there, you would probably get some quite a bit of attention. Oh, yeah, just, just carrying that carrying bag. bag. You around. are so right. <gasps> well, oh, there's the pieces. The pieces. All right. Let's see. And that's cool. They come in a little net bag because if you're playing the beach, you're going to get sand and something, you know? Yeah. So that's awesome. Okay. Ooh. All right, so here is... <gasps> There's the clue. Guessing that's like the cards. Clue cards. Let's take a look at those while he's digging out the other stuff. So, of course... Oh, that's um, funny. Here's the... um. Like the wrench. <laughs> and the, the candlestick. Candle so they're all the rope. Oh, that's cool. So they're like the waterproof. Magnifying glass? Oh, Ooh, it's sure a clue. That. Maybe that's. Um, the knife. The knife, but it looks like a butter knife. <laughs> uh, the lead pipe. Yep. And I think that's it. All right. Then you have your people. Oh, that's so cool. So Miss Scarlet. <laughs> Let's see what we got. What's we'll that? Is it cards. Miss Peacock? <gasps> Miss Scarlet. Okay. Oh, they're. Hold on. I do want to show wrapped. you these, so we will unwrap them real quick. So you're gonna put all those together. Okay. So there's all of our pieces. Um, I want to show you the cards first before I explain about the game pieces. So we do have Miss Scarlet. Um, yeah, no, I was kind of impressed Colonel because Mustard. these are all like, um, you know, like they look like updated versions. They of, are, yeah. Look at that. Ooh, that's really cool on the outside of there. Um, Colonel Mustard. Now, I would have liked if these were a little bit more coded for. Yeah, um, well, especially if you're gonna have them on the beach. Right. Um, but at this price point, they're right, they're good. Right, right. Miss Peacock, Mr. Green, Professor Plum, 
and apparently Dr. Orchid. So um, we're used to seeing uh, Miss White, and so the piece is white, um, and I guess with the dog hair, mice, um, <laughs> that I think she, that's um, Dr. Orchid is supposed to be um, the white piece. Um, so you have your the ballroom, kitchen, hall, all of your rooms here going through. We have the rope, the dagger, the revolver, the lead pipe, the wrench, the candlestick, and then we have these extra cards. Ooh, yeah. We have these extra cards like, Scream, all players rush to the room of your choice. Things that go bump in the night. Pick one player, draw a card at random from from the other, and take a sneaky peek. So you have these things that kind of move the game along to make it a little quicker. If you're roasting out there on the beach. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, and we'll show you how we think um, that those uh, are supposed to be used according to the rules of the other game. So, um, in looking up the rules, we couldn't exactly find them. It does have the uh, the instruction thing right there, but we, yeah, we couldn't find Clue. Couldn't exactly we find to, Clue, uh, which I think they the think everybody knows how to play Clue. So, if you use your <laughs> box <laughs> here, yeah, if you use your box here, this is where you can put the cards um, that you know that you're guessing. Once you separate them all mm -hmm. out and um, and choose, and you can put them in here, and they'll be. You know, that little thing that usually sits in the middle of the game board. Um, so we do have the pieces you were showing. We do not have the revolver, and we didn't understand because we actually have a revolver card. Now, we do have this mystery card, I mean, um, piece, which is actually on the other game. It's on the die. So when you rolled that, you would get um, to choose one of those extra cards. You just, mm -hmm. like, choose it um, from the middle, I guess. And um, that way you would go through those. So I'm guessing if you use this, if you roll a 1, it can count as a 1 when you're moving around the game board. And then you can also choose one of those cards. Yeah. And then I guess you would ha just have to um, draw a revolver on the back of here. I guess so. Or um, make that be the revolver. Because there is a revolver card. They didn't totally um, leave that out. So, anyways. So or there's a couple... Maybe if they have this game right and they have got something different let us know yeah let us know because we we weren't sure this was such a fun idea yeah. um that and of course you know we can we can figure out how to play it would be nice to know a little bit of why um we did find out why we don't have miss white why we have miss orchid but um it would be nice to know why we didn't have the revolver card and yeah. we have that and we don't have it on the die but, um, like I said, this was a really good price point, so that could be um, some of the problem um, with that. But, anyway, as Clue fans, it's now time to show you the entire towel spread out. It is really big it is really cool and square. Well. Okay, so there you have it. There's the whole thing. It looks super it really awesome. Does. Very, very good. Hard to get the whole thing on camera. Now, let's look down. So, right here you have... Start off in the hall. Mm hmm So then you have the lounge. Yep. The dining room. Mm hmm The kitchen. Okay. The ballroom. Yep. The conservatory. Yep. The billiards room. Yep. The library. Mm hmm And the study. Wow. And it even has like the little has like, a little trap doors. Yeah, so the um, the study the has a corner rooms. Yeah, so the study has a secret passageway to the kitchen. So it's like, of course, each corner. If you know Clue, you know exactly what we're talking about. And it has trap doors, so that's really awesome. It looks so cool! It is way... It was really big. Yeah. Bigger than what I was expecting. But it is really awesome. And it could even be a... It's not just a towel. We could literally sit on this as a blanket at the beach. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very cool. All right, so there you have it, the clue, da da, beach travel, beach towel game. What are they calling it? <laughs> Backpack game beach towel set. Um, this was really fun to look at. Uh, there's a, a couple things we could um, do, you know, to uh, to make it a little more clear for us to play the game and stuff, but. It, you can't beat the classic clue. No. And I love how they put that into a travel game. You can just take it with you. And the pieces come apart and you can put them right back together. And put them all in your handy playing, dandy I mean, little you can, bag. You can, um, I guarantee if you laid this out on the beach. Oh my and, goodness. you know, maybe we're going to play later. 
just having it out, like, yes. well, like is going to draw so much attention oh, for sure. Oh, for sure. For like, Wait sure. Minute, isn't that the... And if you have the dice from the other game with the um, thing on there, you could bring it out. Yeah, very true. As well. Like I said, you can draw your own revolver on the back of there if you want. But anyway, so it's nothing you can't look past, but um, I definitely think um, this is a win for De definitely. Clue fans and going to the beach and taking games on the go. So um, we could have really used this this past year. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.